hello students next question is that continuation find out hybridization these following species that is first one is clf3 brfi if7 clo3 minus and clo4 minus in clf3 what is the hybridization of chlorine in clf3 molecule what is the hybridization of chlorine simple that is but that chlorine belongs to seventh group elements chlorine belongs to seventh group element seventh group element can maximum bond seven only so here chlorine can maximum bond seven so one two three four five six and seven here three fluorines are there each fluorine occupy single bonds means that is three fluorines are there so each fluorine occupy single bond f single bond and single bond single bond here four electrons are left these four electrons these two x equal to one lone pair these two x equal to one lone pair here total here two lone pairs are there here one lone pair equal to what i said one lone pair equal to one sigma bond one lone pair considered as a one sigma bond here also one sigma bond here also one sigma bond so here total number of sigma bond here three sigma bonds are there these three single bonds are there three single bonds here also one sigma here also one sigma here also one sigma three sigma bonds and two lone pairs three sigma bonds and two lone pairs total five sigma bonds are there five sigma bond that is equal to hybridization is sp3 d hybridization students once again hybridization depends on number of sigma bonds and lone pairs hybridization depends on sigma bonds and lone pair here three sigma bonds are there three sigma bonds plus two lone pairs two lone pair equal to we consider as a two sigma bonds so simply remember two lone pair equal to consider as a two sigma bonds so total five sigma bonds are there this hybridization is sp3 d hybridization in clf3 molecule chlorine hybridization is sp3 d next question is in brfi what is the bromine hybridization so bromine belongs to 17th group elements or 7th group elements bromine can maximum bonds 7 only so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so here five fluorines are there each fluorine occupy each fluorine occupy single bond so 1 2 3 4 5 5 single bonds are there five single bond equal to five sigma bond each single bond having one one sigma total five sigma bonds are there and here one lone pair is the two electrons are left these two electrons that means one lone pair one lone pair equal to we consider as a one sigma bond so total number of sigma bonds here in brfi total sigma bond six sigma bonds are there that is one two three four five six five sigma bonds and one lone pair one lone pair equal to consider as a one sigma bond so total six sigma bonds are there that hybridization is sp3 d2 hybridization sp3 d2 hybridization and one more example in if7 in if7 what is the hybridization of iodine in if7 what is the hybridization of iodine iodine belongs to 17th group element so, so maximum can bond 7 only that is 7 17th group elements or 7th a group element so maximum can bond 7 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so here seven fluorines are there each fluorine occupy single bonds means 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so your total seven sigma bonds are there the seven sigma bonds that hybridization is sp3 d3 sp3 d3 it is very most important students and next one is in clo3 clo3 minus in clo3 minus what is the hybridization of chlorine in clo3 minus what is the hybridization of chlorine so here chlorine belongs to 17th group elements or 7th group elements chlorine maximum can bond 7 only so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 here in power minus is there so minus means what gain one electron take the one extra electron means one x extra so here total 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 this seven electron belongs to chlorine that is seventh group and x minus means gain one electron extra total eight electrons are there so eight bonds so here here three oxygens are there what i said oxygen is a oxygen is a diatomic molecule so that's why oxygen occupy always two bonds so means this oxygen each oxygen taking two two bonds like this like this so here that means this the double bond double bond having only one sigma bond so here here also one sigma here also one sigma here also one sigma so that means double bond having only one sigma that's why one sigma one sigma here three sigma bonds so here one lone pair is there one lone pair two electrons are left these two electrons equal to one lone pair one lone pair equal to one sigma bond lone pair consider as a one sigma bond so here in clo3 minus total number of sigma bonds here 
one, two, three, three sigma bonds are there, one lone pair is there. One lone pair equal to considered as a one sigma bond. Total number of sigma bonds one, two, three, four. So in ClO3 minus hybridization is sp3 hybridization. sp3 hybridization. ClO3 minus molecule is sp3 hybridization. Next one is another example. Last one is ClO4 minus. In ClO4 minus, same thing. Chlorine belongs to which group? The chlorine belongs to 17th group elements and 7th group element. Chlorine can maximum bond seven only. So hybridization is chlorine. Hybridization of chlorine. So that is one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. In power minus is there. Minus means what? Taking one electron extra. Taking taking one electron extra from outside. So Taking one electron means taking one extra x. So here, so total one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight electrons are there. Means that eight bonds are there. So here each oxygen here four oxygens are there. Each oxygen occupy two bonds. Each oxygen occupy double bond. That means each oxygen taking two bonds means this oxygen taking two x, taking two x one two. It is also taking two bonds. It also taking two bonds. Total. Eight bonds are there. Each oxygen taking two two bonds. So that's why this that means double bond. This means double bond. This double what I said double bonds always having only one sigma bond. So here also one sigma. Here also one sigma. Here also one sigma. Here also one sigma. Total sigma bonds are there. Four sigma bonds are there. Four sigma bond. The hybridation is sp3 hybridation. In ClO4 minus chlorine hybridation is sp3 hybridation. These are the very most important students. Okay, if you like my video. Please like and share and comment. So thank you.